Hello, hello, hello. It's Brandy Janae here. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. I'd like to welcome you if you are new and welcome back if you are returning. In today's video, I'm going to be doing my daily plan with me. So if you're interested in seeing this, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, thank you so much again for coming back. If you have been following me for a little while, then you know that last time I did a daily plan with me, I was using the A5 planner and I switched it up. So, <clears throat> sorry, I was using this one with the life planner on the rings and I don't know... I don't know why, but for some reason, I genuinely just prefer the coils. <laughs> so I decided to take the case off of the memory planner that I have, and I am now using this for my new daily planner, which I did purchase from Amazon. And this uh, cover is from Notique, so it's a little big for this, but it works and it's super cute. So I just have a little bit of pocket deco here from just some miscellaneous things. Um, and of course, it's just a beautiful black crock print. And then this is one of the two covers because you know the Daily Duo comes with two different planners. So this is one of the covers, which I love. Um, I haven't put anything in here yet because yeah. So, but anyway, I use some stickers from, uh, what is this from? Oh, Black Mountain Sticker Co. to just do September's. And I kind of decided that for this part, because I really honestly don't go back to it, I'm going to go ahead and just do a, um, what's this called? Like just social media, just my videos and things like that will just be on this page. So I just kind of put some stickers down and then... Um, same with this. This will all just be social media stuff. Like, I'm not going to worry about trying to use this for anything else because I honestly just don't. So, this works. These little stickers from Black Mountain Sticker Co. are so cute to me. She's so sweet. So, if you haven't checked her out, please go ahead and do so. And then I also have some, like, Boulder Bond stickers. And I just went ahead and stuck those in. So, I'm still working on that. So, then this will be for... September, was it the 5th through the 11th, I believe. So I'm going to go ahead and take this out because it'll be easier to kind of flip it around. I did get these super cute stickers from Ivy and Pip, which is a shop that I found on Etsy today. Um, and so it comes with this sheet, this one, and this is a printable kit. Um, I don't know if I said that or not, but yeah, it is a printable kit. And this one, and I realize now that my sticker mat is like very sticky. So the sticker sheets are sticking together. But I just really liked the neutrals of this. So I'm excited to try it out. I was like, oh, I'm going to buy this one and this one. I was like, nope, mm -mm. let's try it. Make sure it fits. Make sure it works before you go out and buy a thousand more kits. So this is kit 12 and then all was this five pages one two three four five pages of the kit and then you get this little bonus sheet of icons which come with every kit apparently and i absolutely love like i really wish i could just get the icons in different colors because i don't use this in my regular planner but i will definitely use these in my memory planner because they're super cute but i would like to have them in different colors so every kit I know this comes with this page and so it it matches the week so because this has like the neutrals and the greens it goes with this particular kit but if i buy like a brighter kit then the icons will be brighter obviously so anywho i am going to go ahead and lay down the base and then i'll be back
is super cute. Like I really like how everything turned out. One day I'm gonna quit being so incredibly matchy matchy. <laughs> um, especially like, cause this page kind of caused me a little bit of anxiety because it's not the same. Um, I like it, but it's not the same. So I really need to stop being so matchy matchy and then I don't have to worry about it. But yeah, I think it's super cute. I really like how it turned out. So then of course we have this page which I have really, 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 really been enjoying the whole pre-planning aspect of this page for the following week. So I can just kind of scribble on it, even though, I mean, I make it look nice, but I really just kind of scribble on it what's happening for the following week and then just pop it in there. So that has been really nice. I hope, oopsie, I hope this fits here. Cause I just kind of laid it there. Woo, that's tight. Um, so yeah, so for this particular sticker, I would probably lay this one down first and then put that a little bit above <laughs> um, just for the future. And so this one ended up on the 11th. It gave me another set of numbers, but I think I'm gonna just keep using these even though I think they're a little bit bigger but that way I can use the other numbers for something at a later time so yeah I do really really like the colors in this kit though I think it's very pretty and it was easy to cut although I did have to use my silhouette and again if you've been following me, then you know me and the silhouette do not get along very well. I wish there were Cricut files just because I just have such better luck with Cricut. And if there aren't Cricut files, then I wish I knew how to convert them to Cricut files because that would make my life a lot easier. But I am able to make it work, so that's fine. It's just, you know... A lot of shops I've noticed do give you the PNG file, but then now they're starting to put like, hey, I'm giving you the PNG file, but I don't have a Cricut, so I can't really help you use it essentially, <laughs> is what most of them are now starting to, I've noticed are putting in the comments since I've been looking for more printable stickers. So the only other thing is this, which I just noticed now that it is a full sticker and I don't want this tracker on here. So I'm just gonna cut it off as soon as I figure out where I put my slice to. Oh, there we go. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna cut this off because I do not use trackers and I don't quite frankly wanna feel bad about not using it. So I'm just gonna get rid of it and then I won't have to worry about it. So typically on this side, I just do like, which I'll change this heading because I know it says this week, but I typically just make it a grocery list um, or just shopping in general. And then I put, you know, any other information that I may need on this particular side, but typically I just use it for, um, you know, our upcoming shopping needs. And somewhere this is crooked, but you know what? Uh, let grab this. Let's see if I can fix it. I really don't want to use, I have undo. I don't really want to use it, but I think I'm going to have to. I don't, I I ran out of the, my repositional sticker paper. So, um, yeah. This is not, okay. It's not going to let me be great otherwise. So, undo it is. Um, and although that stuff does really, 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 really work, as you can see, God, it smells so terrible. So I don't like to use it. 
But anyway, there we go. It's back. Um, but yeah, oh, it just smells. It smells awful. But it gets the job done. So there we go. I'll probably find some cute little quote or something to put here. It did give me, the kit did come with some boxes. So what I may have to do is just print this particular sheet and cut it again because I don't have enough to do. I usually put a box at the top and at the bottom for my AM and PM routines. And then I like, I have like to have another one for work and you know, things like that. So I'll probably go ahead and reprint this sheet a few more times just so I have the additional boxes which is the best thing about printables because once you have the one you know that you like especially when it's laid out in this way you have the one that you like and then you can go ahead and just um keep using them over and over which is really nice so i am gonna just lay this one down because i'm curious okay so it is one of those it will go after the time so there i typically put the am routine pm routine goes here I was wondering if it was a full length or if it was like you know one of those after the time ones and it is after which is cool so AM routine PM routine which I do have my stickers from those Somewhere. One moment, please. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. So I'm going to put in. Hmm. All right, so I have the AM routine sticker. And I these do obviously have my name on it because I had a sticker shop. But I have since decided to close it. So I, yeah, I'm not selling these anymore, um, which is okay. It's been, I guess, about a week now or so that it's been closed, and I'm doing fine. Like, I was worried that I would be kind of, uh, I don't really want to say lost, but I guess lost, <laughs> um, and, you know, kind of confused about it, but I feel really good about the decision, so I'm not going to worry about it. Um, if in the future I decide to open a shop again, then I will, but as of right now, I am doing okay. So Monday for YouTube, I am going to edit some film. On Tuesday, I'm going to attempt to film again. And then Monday, I know we have a day off. I don't know if I made, I know I have day off stickers, but I don't know if they're in here. I know that I obviously have to go back to work on Tuesday, so we're going to use this larger one. Nope, I think I want to use this really big one for work, because I like being able to put the checkbox in there. So I do have a worked work script sticker. Put that there. Um, like I said, I know Monday is a day off. So I'm going to just pop that in there. Oops. Whoa. Zigged when it should have zagged. We're going to pop that in there. I think I have. in the leftover stickers that I had already printed. Do I have a day off? Yes, I do. Okay. So here is a day off sticker. And I'm not really sure 
don't know if I actually can I have any plans for Monday? No, not yet. <laughs> um Tuesday, I know that I have a sorority meeting at seven. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there. Um, let's use this one. It usually lasts about an hour, so this is perfect. If I can get it laid to lay properly. All right. So I have a chapter meeting at seven, and it'll be on Zoom, which is awesome. And then, let's see. Do I have anything else I wanna put in here for now? I do typically put down, which I'm not sure why, <laughs> but I do typically like to notate what I eat for dinner especially. Like I said, I don't really know why I do that because it's not like I do meal planning or anything, but for some reason, I just like to keep track of it. My daily, I don't know why that one won't come up. My, um, during the day food is typically the same. Like I pretty much eat the same thing every day for breakfast and lunch, but dinner is most likely the one that will vary. So I'm gonna put it on this sticker. And I try to eat, oh, no, that's a full one. I try to eat around six o'clock if possible. So I'll put that one there. This must be one of those oops, sheets that I stuck down in here because I cannot, I did not, this didn't cut well. It's fun. All right, so put those two in there. So I don't know what I'm gonna eat. I've been trying to convince my husband to do tacos on Tuesdays. So hopefully that'll be what we have on Tuesday. And then yeah, so my um, I think that's all I have planned for right at this second. So I'm going to go ahead and just stop the video here and I'll finish the other pages at a later time. I just wanted you to see how the rest of these stickers laid out. So if you're interested in going to pick them up you can kind of be more informed with how they look. Um, but like I said, they're super cute. I really like them. I love the colors and I don't have a ton of them left. I never really use these just because like to me, the dots in the book are sufficient. And because I do kind of skip this one, then I'd have to cut it and that's a whole process. So, um, but these are so cute. Like, I don't know, I may figure out where to put those at. I have these boxes left, but I am gonna have to print another at least one or two sheets of these some of the washi strips and then this is the remaining portion to this and then i used all of the boxes and then of course i do still have the icons that i will be putting aside just for memory planning just because i prefer to use icons in my memory planner so anyway, thank you so, so, so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, again, be sure to leave me a thumbs up and also leave me a comment below if you have any other printable A5 Daily Duo sticker shops that I should check out. Um, I'm really, really, really enjoying this printable route. It's just a lot easier for my budget <laughs> and my planning, you know, style just because I can, um, you know, kind of customize it a little bit more with the printables than you can with the 
kits. So I do enjoy this. I'm excited to purchase some more from Ivy and Pip. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. And as always, have a good day, friends. Goodbye.